Alright guys, hello and welcome to episode 4 of Let's Play Far Cry 5. And apparently we gonna change for better or for worse. Oh, I get to make my own character. Let's make the one... Hmm. Yeah, that's fine. Get a cut. There we go. That's like how I get my hair cut. See if there's anything ridiculous. Oh my god. Maybe. No. No, I can't do it. <clears throat> yeah, yeah, that's about what I wear in real life. Yes, yeah. That's good. That's usually what I wear to work. I got a plain old black cap. Hey, there you go. That looks like I'm about to commit some sort of heist or murder. I kind of like the bandages. These look like the ones I wear at work, too. Uh, yeah, let's go with these. Alright. Yeah, I, I, I dig it. Way better looking than I'll ever be. Aren't we going to burn mine? Dude's got some, uh, peace in Don't know how she's related. Seems like just showed up one day. She'll spin you a sob story, but Faith is a liar and a manipulator. She'll poison your mind with bliss if you'll give her the chance. Anyone who goes wandering into her Henbane River winds up either dead or walking the path to become one of those brain-dead angels doing all the cult's hard labor. <laughs> John Seed, the Baptist. Youngest of the Seed brothers and maybe the most sadistic in charge of recruiting the cult marking cleansing confession atonement those are four steps he puts everyone through to become a member of eden's gate if they survive john tells everyone to accept the power of yes as if a way to get his followers to do whatever the fuck he wants grade a psychopath Jacob Seed, the soldier, oldest brother of the Seeds in charge of training their militia up in the Whitetail Mountains. Only thing he believes in is sacrifice the weak. 
seems to be running a few psychological experiments up north. All sorts of nightmare stories about people turning on one another at the drop of a hat has been linked to the creation of the monster wolves up north and the cult called Judge what monster wolves? I hope that's just a metaphor in our literal like wolves. Joseph Seed, the father. Leading the Project Eden's Gate, he believes a great collapse is coming and thinks of himself as a modern day Noah. Thinks God speaks to him, told him to save as many souls as he can. Now that he started the reaping, his following are willing to die for him. He's had his people build three massive bunker to <clears throat> bunkers to protect themselves when his prophecy comes true. The guy's an absolute nut job. Guess we're killing them. Local fights to use water. Richard Dutch Roosevelt served two nights in jail for contempt of court after contesting his right to collect rainwater in what the state has defined as reservoir. Mr. Roosevelt has operated in this rainwater collection without a proper permit in flagrant violation of Mount Montana laws said the Water Resource Department Deputy Director Edwin Garcia. Mr. Roosevelt is contesting is contesting the charges. Dutch, you there? This is Ray Ray. What the hell is going on? We've, we've heard a mess of gunshots and I, I swore that weren't thunder earlier, but, but a couple of explosions. Boomers all riled up and won't settle down. Is this more of them Peggy's bullshit? How much are we gonna stand for? Anyway, call me back when you can. And take care of yourself. Dutch, you there? This is Ray Ray. Uh. All right, let's head on our way out. I'm sorry, what now? Huh, okay. Aha! Oh, I do get throwing knives! Oh, yes! Joyous bee! You can go ahead and pause that and read it if you want. I'm just, I'm, whew, that was a lot. Same with this. Go ahead and pause the video here and read it. Okay. I'm not going to end this episode until we at least get somewhere. <laughs> um, it's probably right in front of my face, and I'm just ignoring it. There we go. Oh, wow. I'm 
a very dark room and that was very, very bright for me. Um, so whatever my character's reaction was probably very similar to mine. If you're gonna build a resistance, there's some things you need to know. There's four ways you can go about this. First, you can liberate any hostages the cult's taken. These are good people who might just fight alongside you if you help them. Second, you can destroy Eden's Gate property that's all over the place now. Hell, they built two goddamn shrines on this island alone. <coughs> Sounds like my kind of thing. kind of been like head south simulator it seems like you're always heading south metaphorically literally that's blood What's up, bro? Hey, I like your gun. Thank you. make an example of him. Rock! Oh. Okay. What's These up, buddy? fanatics are out of control. If you want to protect yourself, I think there's a prepper stash near the boathouse. Should have some good gear squirreled away. Alright, cool. So, I think we're going to call it here. This has been episode four of let's play far cry i'm having fun so far i've uh i've not played kind of a single based open world game in a while so i'll see you guys in the next episode have a good old time